at the moment there is no payload on this machine this machine is designed to carry four to five kgs right now there is no payload so of course there will be an oscillation because we are missing the right payload motors are just too powerful so ground effect will actually cause some of the wobbling but as you can see when I'm a little higher it's solid all right there she is Let me teach you how to take off in GPS position hold mode. Once all the satellites are locked, okay, once all the satellites are locked, what you need to do is pull both the sticks down either in the center or outwards, from V or outward, upside down V, and the motors will start. As soon as motors start, put the throttle in the mid, more than middle, okay, more than middle, and as soon as your machine rise up at a certain altitude, put the throttle in the middle, and your machine will hold that position. Let us do it. So, here we go. That's it. It's just that easy. It stays right there where you leave it in GPS position hold mode. Make sure the compass calibration is right. Make sure the GPS, all the satellites are locked. Okay, and after that, this puppy is all yours to fly. So in GPS position hold mode, it's really simple. As you can see what I'm doing with my sticks, I wanna go up, I raise the throttle, right is right, left is left, forward is forward, backward is backward. Ooh, lots of wind, lots of wind. And yaw is always in your hands. So once again, if you wanna take off, with me holding the radio this way very awkwardly behind the tripod i will land okay and turn on the motors throttle goes up throttle goes middle that's it that's it i hope i didn't put the sticks away but i can do it again once again hold on all right no payload so it's uh, kind of wobbly with the ground effect That's it. But if you have a payload on it, it might take more, more than 50% or 60% throttle to actually let it get up. Uh, let me put some payload on it and see how it behaves. <laughs> 